there are different types of rolling tactics. When the raider faces the antis, to escape he does a backward roll. The raider extends one leg forward keeping a diagonal stance and brings his body closer to the ground by taking half squat position on the other leg. Once his body is close to the ground, he rolls on his back. In a sideward roll, the raider escapes from the sides when he is caught by chains or individual block. Forward roll is very popular with raiders. Some of the raiders use it while jumping over the antis or the chain. A raider places his hands on the ground and brings his body slowly towards the ground by flexing the elbows and taking his body weight on his hands, taking care not to land on his head while rolling. His knees are to be flexed for easy landing in a diagonal stance to enable him to get up quickly. The raider can reach home either by extending his hands or legs, whichever is nearer to the home court. Buck line raiding tactics are important as sometimes antis make sure that the raider does not cross the buck line and thereby lose a point. A raider should try quick change of movements and footwork to disintegrate the defense and either cross the buck line or make an anti out. Pursuit means a persistent chase. An alert defense can take advantage and raid immediately after the raider withdraws taking him by surprise. It could be a straight pursuit or a diagonal pursuit. A straight pursuit is when the path of a pursuer is straight off parallel to sidelines. It is slightly risky and raider should not follow the retreating raider blindly but change his direction towards the center line to avoid possible catches from other antis. In Kabaddi, the defense has to have a system of playing where the players are assigned specific functions. This becomes more important as while the play is in progress, the number of defense players may fluctuate when they are made out by the raider. The players should know when to use a particular situation, what to use and where to use a given strategy. When the entire team of seven players is in the court, the defense should be placed in these formations. The 2-3-2 two, two system. The 2-2-1-2 two, two, two mobile system. The 1-2-2-2 two, two, two system. When there are six players in the court, the formation should be the 2-2-2 two, two, two system. The 1-3-2 system. The 1-2-2-2 2-1 system, if 5 players are left, the system should be the 2-1-2 two, two system, the 2-2-1 two, two, system, the 1-3-1 one, one system. With only 4 players in the court, the formation is the 2-2 two, two system, the 1-2-1 one, one system,
Kabaddi is an athletic game where, like rugby, wrestling, judo, etc., a person has not only to be physically fit but also mentally fit. The movements of Kabaddi demand that he should have an excellent presence of mind, redefining the tactics with any change of situation as the ups and downs of the game are at every step. After rising like the sun in the east, Kabaddi is all set to shine and win the hearts of all the sports lovers in the world. Where else would one find a game so exciting, thrilling and down to earth financially? Kabaddi has the skill of judo, energy of soccer, strength of rugby, thrill of cricket, patience and brains like chess, giving the spectators an entertainment like no other game. Kabaddi is sure to shine brighter in the coming times to dazzle the world of sports when the chant would reverberate all over Kabaddi Kabaddi Kabaddi